to my youtube channel if you are new here my name is kate if you are not new thank you for watching another vlog so it's currently monday it's 7 30 in the morning i'm sitting on my bed i took everything off of it and i'm about to wash my sheets and wash everything because today is going to be a monday reset vlog yesterday was easter and i went home and slept over at my mom's house and when i came back last night the apartment was like quite a mess <laughs> i just want to do like a deep clean clean the counters vacuum maybe mop the floors stuff like that wash my bed and just get back on track for the week so i already had my breakfast i had some oatmeal this morning with frozen raspberries and almond butter which i haven't had in so long i used to eat that literally like every morning and i had it for the first time in like such a long time so that was my breakfast i did some journaling and i'm about to do my ice rolling as well as meditation i do this every single morning i'm gonna go on youtube and do my favorite meditations that i've showed before so I'm gonna do it on my bed because Zach is out on the couch. So I'm just gonna do it on my bed and use my ice roller, which I show all the time from Amazon. We'll link it down below. Three people top, shown before so many times, and then my TNA butter little biker shorts and my Adidas switch runs. So that's my workout fit, and I'm gonna do a little upper body class because today is Monday. Monday I do upper body and I have a whole week of workouts on my YouTube channel which I did not too long ago so if you want to see more in depth of my workout routine definitely go and check that out because I show all the workouts that I do and everything like that. No sweetener and extra salted caramel cold foam. I've got decaf, iced coffee, and sweetener with salted caramel cold foam. Yes. And then what did you want? A tall iced chai with almond milk and sweet cream. Sorry, coffee. Coffee. Okay. And then can I get a grande? A tall, a tall ch iced chai. With almond milk. With almond milk. Cold foam. And sweet cream cold foam. Anything else? <laughs> That's going to be it. You got it. Bro. I appreciate it. <laughs> Almost 10 o'clock. I'm back at the apartment now. We just went to Starbucks, did a little Starbucks run, and I also went to the gym apartment because a little change of scenery is always nice. So I did my little upper body workout at the gym, but I, of course, just got a nice chai, almond milk, sweet cream, cold foam, and then I also got egg bites because I, I don't know, I'm just like craving them. And these are like my favorite. I got the red pepper ones. So I'm gonna eat these, drink my chai, and then hop in the shower.
So I'm out of the shower and I'm gonna do a face mask. I have Weekly Reset by Loops. Not even gonna get into it because I talk about these face masks all the time in like every single video that I do. But favorite face masks, always linked down below and they're just so fun. And I'm doing this new thing called no makeup Mondays, where I don't wear any makeup on Mondays just to get my skin ready for the week. Monday is the day where I don't wear any makeup. They're so weird too sometimes because sometimes I feel like they fit my face like perfectly and then sometimes they're like too big for my face. Like this side is shorter than this side. And it's like on my hair. But it's fine because they're just so cute and fun. So I'm gonna leave this on for a little bit and I'm gonna plan my day now. I feel like whenever I film videos and do like weekly resets or like a Monday reset or whatever, I feel like my day always goes by slower because I'm filming everything and like explaining everything. But when I do this, when I'm not filming, it goes by a lot quicker so i'm gonna plan my day and do a little bit of work and like get my day started since it's already 10 30 while well, i have my little face mask on right now I got a little bit of work done planned my day and my week I also did my skincare for the day and I wasn't gonna show it because I feel like I show my skincare so many times and I don't want to bore you and like just repeat myself so many times so but I just made some lunch I had some sausage in the fridge that I made a couple days ago and then some quinoa with butternut squash and then some zucchini it's just like a frozen little thing that you just put in the microwave and it's just super easy and they're like my favorite so this is gonna be my lunch and i also need to fill up my water because i haven't had that much water today but i'm just gonna have my lunch and then we can get on with the deep cleaning because i haven't cleaned yet and zach just left to go to work everything is just easier when he's not here for my little lunch dessert if you know me biggest sweet tooth always need to have something sweet after lunch and dinner. And also, if you feel that way, like it's literally fine. I was watching this girl on TikTok and she was like, I literally cannot eat lunch or dinner without having something sweet afterwards. And I was like, girl, me too. So I am gonna have half of one of my little Easter cookies that I got from Tate. They're so good, by the way. I'm obsessed with them. They're just like so cute. I don't even want to eat it. So I'm going to have half of this little pink Easter egg cookie because it's freaking adorable. It's so good. So this is my little dessert after my lunch. So I'm going to get to cleaning now. I just cleaned off the entire counter so I can wipe it down. I have these two cleaners, one from Method. It's an all-purpose cleaner. And then this one is seventh generation disinfecting cleaner. And I don't know. I just really like these two. I like the smell of them. So I'm just going to wipe everything down and do all of the countertops and make sure they're nice and clean. I also just like to go in with these disinfecting wipes and I just go around and wipe down all of the cabinets and the handles and stuff like on the cabinets because they tend to get like very sticky and yucky very fast. So I'm just going to take these and just wipe down all of the cabinets and the handles.
changed into shorts because I'm sweating from cleaning, but I just have on these little TNA shorts from Aritzia, but I did the bathroom. I cleaned the bathroom and did the counters and stuff, and then I also wiped down the fridge and stuff with stainless steel cleaner because it always gets fingerprints on it and it's so annoying. Like I, that's what I hate about stainless steel is that it gets so dirty and like you can see all the fingerprints. But I'm gonna finish up cleaning. I'm probably gonna vacuum now because the floor is so dusty and my hair is all over this apartment. Like it grosses me out so much because my hair just falls out. Like there's no tomorrow. Like, and when I take a shower, I could make an animal out of the hair that comes out of my head. Let me know if you relate because I have so much hair. My hair is so thick. It just falls out everywhere. Let me know if you struggle with that, but I'm gonna finish up cleaning and do some vacuuming. made myself a little smoothie. I did blueberries, raspberries, blackberries, spinach, frozen banana, almond butter, and some protein powder. Topped it off with some coconut and cacao nibs. In fact, I'm gonna add more coconut because I'm obsessed with coconut. Hey. Say hi. <laughs> Hi. I just got a FaceTime with Zach, but I was just drinking this. This is like the best one that I've made. I usually do this combo a lot, but I don't know. Something about it today just tastes really good. But I'm going to finish up my smoothie and do a little bit of more work on my computer. So I'm going to do a little bit of meal prepping right now. I just put the stove on and put some olive oil and a little bit of butter in my pan. This is from Our Place. It's this beautiful red color. I'm so obsessed with this pan. Literally nothing sticks to it. It looks brand spanking new and i've used it so many times so i will link this down below it's like my favorite pan ever but i have some chicken tenders that i'm gonna cook just on the pan and season it with some pepper and then i also have this garlic lime and cilantro seasoning and then i'm just gonna chop up some garlic and then this broccoli i'm gonna roast it in the oven chop it up drizzle olive oil salt and pepper i just love cooking with chicken tenders because they're so much easier rather than like chicken breast because it's just like so big and you have to cut it in half sometimes so i always go for chicken tenders so i'm just gonna make this really quickly just so we have some dinner and lunch options in the fridge Hello vlog, it is so much later now. I think it's almost like nine o'clock and I'm about to do my skincare and wash my face. I'm also gonna gua sha because I have this facial oil. It's juniper carrot seed face oil and I didn't have a face oil before so I was kind of holding off on the gua sha because it was like tugging at my skin and that kind of like defeats the whole purpose of using it. So I'm gonna do that. But I'm gonna wash my face with my Dr. Bronner's pure castile soap but i know that i've been saying that i'm trying to steer away from this and stick to like gel consistency um face washes but my skin is like acting so weird right now i don't know why i keep doing this but yeah like my skin is just being weird and so i'm trying to get back into my regular routine which was washing my face with like a gel cleanser in the morning and then this at nighttime and i feel like my skincare has just been like out of whack a little bit but i'm gonna wash my face with this that being said this is gonna be my nighttime cleanser i'm also gonna use my little electric face brush i love using this because i feel like it just really gets my skin clean rather than just like using my hands you know and i didn't wear makeup today so it's not like my skin is 
dirty or anything, but I just like a nice clean face for the nighttime before I go to bed. I'm also going to use my Garnier Micellar Water. Even though I didn't wear makeup, I still like to use this to make sure all the gunk and oil and grossness is off of my face. So I just take it on a little cotton pad. I just like to make sure the products that I put on earlier are like definitely off my face, like my sunscreen and stuff. So I make sure to get my neck. Okay, so I'm going to try the oil now. And oils always used to scare me because I have such acne prone skin. So we'll see how this goes. But I'm just going to take a little bit, not a lot. But I'm going to take my gua sha now and attempt to do this the right way. I always watch videos of people doing this and I feel like I know what I'm doing, but we'll see. It just feels really nice and I feel like it's doing something for me. So that's why I like it. So I'm not going to put on moisturizer because I have the oil all over my face and that would just be too much but I am going to put on some of my jet lag mask under my eyes for like a little bit of an eye cream. I'm also going to put on some calamine lotion because I have some blemishes on my forehead like I said and this is what's always on my face when I wake up in the morning and I have like pink stuff all over my forehead. My mom actually showed this to me and I've been using it ever since as like a spot treatment and I swear by it, it works so well. Last up is my Laneige lip mask. So I'm gonna end off this vlog here. I hope you enjoyed this video and enjoyed spending the day with me as I did my little Monday reset, clean the apartment, cooked, showed you what I ate, all that stuff. So I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video, follow me on TikTok, Instagram. Thank you so much for watching. I love you and I will see you next time.